hello guys i welcome you to my channel let's get graphics and multimedia my name is rafi yaku i welcome you to another interesting segment of our online payment gateway with flutterwave.com and hello guys i welcome you to my channel let's get graphics and multimedia my name is rafi yaku i welcome you to another interesting segment of our online payment gateway with flutterwave.com and in this part of our flutterwave tutorial i'm going to teach you guys how you can uh, update your bank information into the on, onto the website so that you get your fund into your bank account in nigeria so follow me as i take you around the step by step on how you can do that now the first step you have to take when you open your flutter with account i say new account so you need to provide your phone number from the first uh, column here you need to provide your phone number that is a phone number that can be that can read that flutter with can use to reach you in terms of uh, transaction alerts or uh, security alerts so in this regard i'm going to enter my phone number for on this uh, website so I'm going to enter uh, so you have to come here and uh, choose your country so I'm in Nigeria so you have to just scroll down and uh, look for for your country Okay, so this is Nigerian. Then now type in the phone number. So going to be oh eight one three two. Okay, three two. So I'm going to start from uh, three two six four four eight four four so that is a phone number then a verification code will be sent to that mail uh to that phone number for verification so you have to enter the code immediately you receive the code so i'm going to enter the code here Uh, nine six and click on submit so now see the phone number has been verified so the next step here is to tell them your bank name so that the bank that will, they will be using to send your phone payment so you have to click on here and choose the bank you you are using for the transaction so in this regard i'm going to use one of my uba bank so i have to scroll down and uh, look for united bank for africa so so in, in this uh this part you need to be very careful your of your, in the information you have provided because this is where your money will be sent to so then you have to come here and provide the account number of the bank you supply so here i'm going to type in the account number all right then the next step here is BVN. So you have to enter your BVN also. So when you enter your BVN, you click on Hard Account and continue to the next step. So after click on uh, Hard Account and continue, it's going to take you to this uh, this page. So the next thing you have to do. So you can see from the top here that we have successfully had a bank account which means that 
this account is where we are going to receive whatever fund we are collecting from this platform right so the next step here is that we have three feet left so part of the 3d three uh feeds left is that you need to provide your what type of the business you do right so i'll come here i'll call it uh freelancing okay online sales of digital skills okay so next thing here you have to type in is address where you stay okay so they will know that you are not doing a fraud business Okay, so you have to scroll down again and uh, let me scroll down here you provide the type of industry so what type of industry your service belong to okay so when you click on here then you scroll down and look for which one that is suitable to your business so uh, I'm going to education yeah Education is related to sales of uh, sales of online digital skill. Okay, so with that, come to submit compliance information. So you can see that compliance information submitted successfully. Now you have you are now in your dashboard fully now you can create a payment link you can receive payment any moment from now once your your verification uh, have been successfully done so flutterwave is going to send you a mail that your compliance form has been approved and uh, you can start receiving payment from the account any moment from now and i hope you guys learn one or two things in this video if you enjoy this video give this video a big thumbs up and if you have any question for me as far as this tutorial is concerned please put your question in the comment section down below and uh, don't forget to like this video share this video and uh, i hope to see you guys in my next video thanks for watching and see you soon bye